We've seen both the leading championship contenders suffer from the pressures of a turbulent 2008 season. Mistakes have been made on both sides, adding to the intensity here in China. You know, I understand there's, there's a lot of pressure, but I keep it outside the bubble, you know. I feel uh, in the position to, to do my job in the best way I can. Both drivers have been intent on projecting a calm and relaxed persona, but despite outward appearances, it's no easy task keeping your head under pressure, as many who face the challenge can testify. Some people relish it and, 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 and love it, and other people you know, find the pressure sometimes uh, uh, overbearing. And Michael used to go very quiet. He, he would just go extremely quiet, wouldn't talk about general things, and you could just see he was... Uh, it wasn't tightening up, but he was just getting very intense. No, it's, a, it's about minimizing mistakes, it's about managing risk, it's about making intelligent decisions with very little information and, and very, very quickly. When it really matters, like at the, at the end, uh, it becomes very difficult to make decisions. When you are under pressure and we, when you have to concentrate your abilities uh, and all, all your energy on one thing, uh, the true side of yourself comes out. That's normal for human being, I believe. It's tough being the focus of so much attention whilst you're trying to just concentrate on the job in hand. Then there's the added stress that comes from your peers. Fernando Alonso has declared his support for Felipe Massa, whilst Adrian Sutil is firmly behind his old mate Lewis. He's a favourite. For my opinion, the, um, the best driver in this year, and he deserved the championship. I think Felipe is a bit more relaxed uh, because it's probably his first real crack at, crack at one, um, which you might think that you know, should feel more pressure. But I think that um, you know coming to these two races last year for, for Hamilton obviously doesn't have great great memories of these two races for himself. Everybody would get uh, more nervous than you would maybe at the beginning of the year, but um, he's shown over the past years that he can handle that without any problems. Um, so I don't think that's an issue for him. Talking specifically about Felipe, I think he's very eager to do it. Very, very, very. But it's a different pressure. It's the Italian press. Um, it's it's the whole team. It's Montezemolo. It's it's the story of Ferrari. Whoever wins it, uh, whoever has the most points in the end deserves it. So it doesn't matter which way you get it, as long as you get it.